Okay, well, this is your chance to do audience participation. Okay, we, part of the musical history of any music is that how songs travel across the world and they adopt new names and new titles and new songs, I mean new words, lyrics is the word I'm thinking of. And the song I'm thinking about is, about is the song when you play Jack in the Box and something pops up, what's the song? Anybody remember the song? Pop Goes the Weasel. Pop Goes the Weasel. So you're going to pop a balloon when it's time to pop, okay? All around the mulberry bush, the monkey chase the weasel. And I looked up the, a little bit of history on this song. It actually started in England in the mid, somewhere in the 1800s. It came over to the U.S. in the later part, around 1880s, something like that. And it had changed, the words changed, came to the U.S. But nobody really knows what the words mean. Pop goes the weasel. But there's different variations on, oh, it could mean this, it could mean this, it could mean this, but there's no documentable evidence that it really means anything. But we still use the same words <laughs> that's been going around for years. So I'm going to play the tune on the carillon, and it's your turn to pop the balloons. And we'll see how many of you can get as close to the beat as possible. I'll be playing it only one time. The last group didn't do very good. <laughs> 